So remember a few days ago when I sold the neighbor's things? Well, that had some knock-on consequences. And today we're going to find out exactly that by playing another brand new Hello Neighbor mod called The Subway. I spawned in the world and I'm locked in, out, definitely in. I'm guessing the neighbor's house is up here. Squidward's door is right there so we can ask for him for help if we need any. Apart from that, we need to get going because this is The Subway. Looks pretty intense, not going to lie. Can I open these? I can. There's literally nothing. Oh, there's a key card. I'm going to take this. These look like those magic boxes. You know when someone like, you know when someone saw someone in half? That's what these look like. <laughs> oh, it literally told me the key cards were down here. Okay, that's fine. Um, Do I need to check my belongings at all? I don't think I do. I think this is the first puzzle, you know. Can I use it on here? Why do I always do that? Okay, that works. That works too. Now can I just open it? Yeah! <laughs> no security required. I can also get something from the vending machine as well. I'm gonna grab some, whatever this is. I guess it's tomato juice and a picture of the neighbor's mouth. But I can't actually grab it, unfortunately. Right, let's go and see if we can find the neighbor anywhere. Welcome to the first station. I believe there are four stations in total. And oh, here he is. I told you! The neighbor is now homeless. And this is all my fault because I, I I sold all his things! I'm gonna throw this at your head. It just bounced off. I'm so sorry. I actually feel terrible. The, the guy is all brown. It looks like he's jumped in some kind of grossness. He's crying. He's got a can for a pillow that I've now just thrown. But this is crazy. This isn't just a mod. This is like a full recreation of a brand new, like, Hello Neighbor level. This is crazy. Right, let's go over here. I spotted a door and it has a giant clock above it. Right, there's a book, a pipe, a key, and a key card. Okay, the key card I've done, but now I need a book, a pipe, and a key. Oh, what does this do? Should we pull it? Let's do it. Okay, I can hear noise. Did something open down here somewhere? Or did this open? I'm like underneath the ground. What is through here? So, um, oh, I thought that said TDM. It says two. There's like a massive library. I need a book. I definitely need a book. But how do I open it? Can I remove these planks? This is, this is really cool. I didn't think it was going to be like this. Open. Did it work? No. The exit is there. Uh, what were the other things on the list? A book, a pole, and a blue key. Okay, let's, um, I feel like this turned something off, so let's turn that back on. And let's go and see if we can find, oh, it's literally that. Well, that's not good, is it? I'm looking in all the trash cans and stuff, but I can't find anything. I'm looking in all the vending machines too, but I don't see anything suspicious just yet. Anything up here? No, I'm so confused. Neighbor! I need to talk to you. Can I take this bag off of you, please? I just need to see if you've got anything that I need to get out of here. I will get you your house back. I'm so sorry. Maybe they're up here, actually. Nope, these are all key cards. What about in here? Nope. Don't let people watching me get out of here. It didn't even break. Ah, is that all I needed to do? But I swear this wasn't open before. All I need is a single book. I believe it was blue, I think. I also need a pipe. And there's a giant lever here. Let's see what happens. Secret door? Dude! Look at this! It's like some secret parkour course. This is crazy, dude. Are we actually doing... We're actually doing Hello Neighbor Parkour. Okay, this is where I could fail badly. I'm guessing there's something at the end that we need. Uh, let's go this way. Nope. I mean, the running is bad enough in Hello Neighbor. It doesn't really need any help to get any harder. Could I just go up this way? I can. Okay, that's good. Oh, we need that big book, do we? Can I knock it down? That was a terrible throw. I need ammo. Give me ammo. Let me see if I can get it from here. We can do the super powerful throw. <laughs> it like stuck to it and crashed. No! Okay, the thing about this one is it doesn't actually save. So if we mess up, we mess up proper and we have to do the whole thing again. Or if it crashes. Either one. Oh, there's further that we can go. I didn't realize we could go through again. So this is for the... Oh my goodness, what is this? More parkour, it's all flooded. Can I... I can walk in it. Okay, that's good. SpongeBob's... Nope, Squidward's door is here. Compress this, and that does something that opens this. Oh, I get a crowbar. 
so I can open this. Okay, this is a little bit easier. This must be where the other key is because we've had the book, but this one is different. This one is a ramp. Okay, okay. You know what? Three, two, one, launch me. Thank you. Look at this insane thing. So if I fall, do I literally just get ground up into meat? Not sure if I'm a fan of that, to be honest. Oh, is this the pipe that I need? I think it is. It's absolutely huge. And I can do some parkour -y bits this way as well to get something else. Maybe I need a specific pipe. Oh my goodness, this is actually crazy. You know I hate parkour, guys. And this is just, this is just the next level. Be careful. Be careful, because otherwise, you're being ground into burgers, buddy. Oh. Oh, it's a golden one. Is that a golden one? It is. It, it kind of looks like a gun, but I think I've got it. I don't really want to, um, I don't really want to go in there, to be honest. That seems like a bad idea. Let's see if I can get out the other way. No! Okay, we're fine. We're absolutely fine. That could have been bad. How do I get back over there, though? Can I jump this way? I can. Okay, that's much better. This guy's actually got a really good jump on him, actually. Right, it's all good. We have the we have the golden pipe, so we don't need the giant one. Where did the giant one go? There it is. Oh, bam! <laughs> this is, like, disguised as a key. It's so weird. Right, on to the next one, where we need, like, literally a blue key. It's all just completely blocked up. And here are some of the tomato plants that we know so well. He's got a little garden down here. How cute. He's growing boulders as well. Right, number four. We can just open this door. But what's behind? The painting. There is... Oh, this can go outside. This can just live out here in the garden. This is a giant hanging house. My mind is blown. My mind is actually blown. Do I have to do this whole thing? I could just jump this, right? There we go. But how do I do this bit? It's like, do you remember those puzzles where you have like the hoop and then you have to put it round the ring and if you touch it, it zaps you? It's kind of like that. This is creepy. Super creepy, but also amazing. This is, this is fan made. A fan made mod level. Oh, almost fell. Almost fell. Okay, these up bits are actually quite difficult because you have to jump them. Go. Yes, I made it to the new house. Look at this. He's got vending machines all over the place. Who are you? You're someone different. I don't want to get in there. <laughs> I don't want to spend more time with you than I have to. I can't even remember what I was looking for. Look, there's a tiny little, um, the tiny little train. That's cool. And here's the big security desk that we all know of. <laughs> Sorry, chair. Let's go upstairs. I, I can't go upstairs. How do I do this? There must be a, a lever, a switch somewhere. What's that? Oh, it's just a, it's just a wheel. Excuse me. I'll poke you with this. Can you tell me, um, can you tell me what's going on? You kind of look like a superhero. Add a cape to this guy, and he's looking pretty super. There must be something I can press. What was that? What was this? A box with a, a one on it? It looks like there might be a secret door here, actually. Yeah, there's definitely something secret there, but how do I open it? Oh, maybe I can put this in here. Did that work? <laughs> I don't even think it could fit, actually. No, I can't. Oh! Okay, uh, let me grab a plate and let's smash this. What's in here? I feel like maybe I need to throw more things at these paintings. Yeah, okay, right, let's get throwing. This is so odd. I'm guessing we need to get to the big one at the back. Hopefully there's enough things for me to throw. Oh, did it, did it, did it, is it open? It must be the top. I thought there was a secret door there, but no. Here is the annoying door. Here is the key. The golden key. Oh, this is phenomenal. I love that these mods have golden items in. But how on earth do I get out of here? I'm going to jump it and see what happens. That was magical. Okay, cool. Play it cool. Yes! Okay, right. We need to go back to the other parkour bit and try and get the golden book now. And then we've done the first station, which is so cool. It's like a full Hello Neighbor act in itself. Also worth noting that the neighbor was homeless at the beginning, but then he got himself a house. <laughs> but was it the same guy? Who knows? They had different outfits on, so it could have been completely different. Open, please. Thank you. Open. Open. Get out of here. Right. We need to do some parkour. I love this giant room opening. It's so epic. It needs like... Dun, 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 kind of music. Right. How on earth do we get over there? I think that's the book, but I don't know. As long as it doesn't crash this time, because I'll be mad if it does. I'll have to do the whole thing again. Right, okay. Can we just run and jump and grab it? I kind of don't want to throw a book again, just in case it crashes. Oh, I can't jump over. Oh, I can! 
I'm literally on the edge of the level. Hey, here we go. I don't want to touch the thing that crashes, though. Um, let's go. Yes. Yes, I got it. Yes, I don't know if that's the way you're supposed to do it, but I don't care. I've got all the items. Check out for Dan how much for all these items. We've got the book. We've got ourselves the key. And we've also got ourselves a pipe. Look at these things. These things are probably worth a fortune. More than your golden apple, sir. Right, let's go. So we should be able to do this. Yes. And then we've also got uh, the book. Yes. And what's last? The key, of course. Are we done? Yeah, okay. This is a little bit weird. Or not what I was expecting. It's still half past two in the afternoon or in the morning. It's probably in the morning because the neighbor's that weird. We have a phone as well. Is that the end? Was that the end? Why is it playing the credits? What are you doing? That can't be it. No. Wait, it might be. It said four platforms. Those were the four platforms. No. I am an idiot. I really thought that there were four separate platforms, but no. Those were the four separate platforms. <laughs> I don't mind though. This is actually the craziest one that I've seen so far. And this came in, was it second place? Yeah, it was second place in the mod competition that I was talking about. And it's interesting that it provides some kind of like weird backstory on two neighbors. Maybe just one. Maybe he's just a victim of the train crash or everyone in the world of Hello Neighbor looks exactly the same. This is impressive. For a fan-made project, this is incredible. It's got creative parkour. You don't actually have to run away from the neighbor. It kind of makes you feel sorry for the neighbor, which is quite cool. It's got new golden items that you need to use to be able to complete things as well. I'm also curious whether you can open this or the beginning. Look at that. It looks like the tunnel to heaven. It looks great. <clears throat> no, I don't think you can open that at all. There's no electronics attached to it. So even though it looks like the mother of all exits, I don't think we're going to make it up there. Can I just throw this? Let's see what happens. Nope, <laughs> that, that properly bounced off. <laughs> Be free, dustbin. You can do it. Go. You've let me down. You've really let me down. I'm kind of curious to see whether you can actually throw this to knock the book off. Because I know you can knock the book off. With the gun and stuff. But obviously we don't have the gun. It might crash. We're going to do it anyway. Here we go. Yep. I, um, I crashed it. <laughs> don't throw the book at the big painting. Everyone will die. Oh, look, we are kind of in a city. There's even buildings outside. That's cool detail. And the turbines are crazy as well. I love how quirky it is. It's still as quirky as the original Hello Neighbor. I love it. No, no. Oh, I was trying to, I was trying to go and see the other neighbor again, but I can't do it. Nope, it's not going to happen. We don't need to see him again anyway. It's fine. All I'm worried about is this guy right here. Let me just build you some kind of house. The best I can do is a pyramid. That, that's all I've got. I mean, we probably could build this up quite a way with all these boxes, you know. <laughs> the boxes don't like behaving themselves though. So you know what? I'm just going to leave it here. See? Just terrible. He's got one box on him already. We could just like layer him up with boxes and see if this works. But the boxes literally don't even want to help you out. Even the boxes don't love you right now. It's a sad time to be the neighbor. But anyway, guys, that's pretty much it for the Subway Hello Neighbor mod. I thought this was awesome. I love this. And this was second place. So in theory, first place is going to be even better, which is the Hello Doctor, Mr. Doctor. The neighbor turns into a crazy doctor, which sounds amazing. So if you enjoyed this and would like to see that one very, very soon, then please leave a big fat thumbs up, a big like. That'd be greatly appreciated. And if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, and if you haven't done so yet, why don't you hit that subscribe button to join Team TDN today for daily videos. Apart from that, guys, thank you again so much for watching. Have an amazing day. You're awesome. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Yeah.